Michael J. Fox is reprising his role as Marty McFly in Lego Dimensions, joining Elizabeth Banks, Chris Pratt, and more stars in this Toys to Life game. Warner Brothers Interactive Entertainment has announced many of the voice cast members for Lego Dimensions, with Fox and Christopher Lloyd re-recording lines for the Back to the Future portion of the game. In addition, Pratt and Banks are back as Emmett and Wildstyle from the Lego Movie, with Alison Brie and Charlie Day also providing voices from their characters from the film. Gary Oldman will serve as the main villain in Lego Dimensions called Lord Vortech. Community's Joel McHale, meanwhile, is providing the voice of X Poe, the game's robot guide. Other notable actors contributing to Lego Dimensions include. Peter Capaldi as the 12th Doctor, Troy Baker as Batman, and Irfan Khan from Jurassic World. Now, I love the fact that they're trying to get, I guess, as much of the actual actors and actresses in for these roles that they did play in their movies. And one other thing is that Chris Pratt is kind of pulling a double duty. He's going to be voicing the Emmett character from the Lego movie, but he's also going to be voicing his character from the Lego Jurassic World, or from Jurassic World, into the Lego form in this movie. Now, there has been like a few news articles we heard about the Doctor Who going to be, the Doctors are going to be in the Lego dimensions, and we are going to have the original voice act, the voice act, the actor who plays the Doctor, once I can talk, the actor who plays the Doctor, currently Peter Cabalti, to voice the Twelfth Doctor. But there are some, there is a trailer that they, that has been released that shows all these voice actors and the roles they're doing. Now, not only from the Doctor Who series do we have Peter Cabalti, but Jenna Coleman is coming to voice, I guess, Clara, and I think Missy's going to be part of it too, because the actress who played her in the past, this previous season and this upcoming season is listed on there as well. One other thing to note was uh, the actor who played Shaggy in the first two Scooby-Doo live-action movies is listed on there as well. And immediately during, well, during the video itself, the trailer video, it showed his name and then cut to Shaggy running and being voiced. So he must be here to voice his character that he had. But one thing I've been saying every time about this LEGO Dimensions game, this looks like it's going to be a great, awesome game for lots of people to enjoy and play because it dips into so many movie franchises, not just present but past, and uh, not only movies but currently TV shows too, like Doctor Who. And I saw something that I thought was interesting but I could also bring up on here. I saw on the back of a display, a display box for the LEGO Dimension starter pack. It listed all the worlds and stuff. Also listed is Midway Arcade. I wonder if this means that they could actually dip into the Midway, I guess, worlds and stuff that they did. I mean, Midway kind of dips into what, Rampage? Maybe even Mortal Kombat, I think. Unless Warner Brothers and... Well, it is Warner Brothers in charge of the game, too. But I think it would also be NetherRealm's decision as well. 